Hello everybody, I am live from Haneda Airport. I'm about to take a flight from Tokyo to Aomori where I'm going to be doing a location shoot and I thought I would spend about 5-10 minutes with you here in the airport to take a look and see what the domestic terminal here at Haneda looks like. Now there, there, there's two terminals, one of them is for um, JAL and one of them is for ANA. So this one is for um, JAL. You can see over here is the uh, <laughs> on the other side there is a gel plane headed to gosh I don't need I don't even know where that is going but you can see it has the Tokyo 2020 Olympics logo on the side of it it is a beautiful day here in Tokyo So before we get on the plane, I might buy a gift. And this is a gift shop here. So let's take a look at some of the stuff that they have. Good old beer. <laughs> but then there's a tea here. This is my favorite green tea. Um, this is Itoya. Oh, sorry. Um, Ito tea, this is really good. Oh, this looked really interesting. This was in the thumbnail. This is Monjayaki. But it's made by Kalbi, which is a company that makes potato chips here. Oh, good old pretz. There's some more. Edo Monja. See, Monja Yaki is a big deal here in Tokyo. That's like their Okonomiyaki. Whoa, space food! Oh, who doesn't love like the free... Whoa, this is so cool. Freeze-dried astronaut food. This is chicken rice. This is pudding. This is a milk crepe. Uh, this this looks like um, mabo tofu or w which one is this? Something with tofu, vanilla ice. Cream. Whoa, whoa! Space okonomiyaki. Honto? Oh no! Did, uh, do astronauts? Do astronauts eat this stuff? Oh wow! Space takoyaki. All right, I gotta get, I gotta try this. Space takoyaki. Uh, what else do they got? Uh, there's lots of gifts. See, in Japan, when you travel, you wanna buy a gift and bring it with you. And then it's something that you can give to people. So the boxes are usually really pretty. This is all monjayaki. Here's some ramen. These look pretty cool. It was like a giraffe. It's a pudding omelet. There's some furikake. Oh, this is wasabi taste. Nikuman. Here's some tenmushi. These are like steamed uh, yone ske. Oh, these are pretty cool. Oh, katsu sando oishiso. Oh, oishiso. Kore wa nan desu ka? Ah, ano, almond chocolate sando. Kochira desu ne. It's so good. I'm getting it. That's a good one to get for a present for my friends in Aomori. Whoa! Premium cheese tart. This looks so good as well. No, what 
is this? The Tokyo Tokyo Jewel Ruby Roll Ruby. Strawberry and um, mochi all rolled up in a cake. This is this should be illegal. This looks so darn good. I don't know if I don't know if I want to take that all the way with me. I'm just gonna stick with this. I actually I actually don't have that much time. <laughs> I always get an official receipt. All right. This is so awesome. So if I have time, oh, walk a later. <laughs> gotta take the walk a later. I gotta go to gate 18, and my flight leaves in uh, 20 minutes. The walk later's talk. So usually, um, domestic, it's Anna and Jal, which are the two main carriers here, they're separated. So this one is Jal. Jal is the airline I'm taking to go to Aomori. Uh, I like Jal better than Anna, I'll be honest with you. I don't know why. I think it's because it's red and I went to Ohio State University. I like the colors. Anna's blue and that's Michigan and I don't like Michigan. I don't like any, I don't even like to say the word Michigan. All right, so we're almost there, gate 18. This is the most famous of the Tokyo gifts, the Tokyo banana. Tokyo banana. <laughs> she nodded, yeah. <laughs> All right. I don't, you know, Haneda Airport looks pretty much like any other airport. The international terminal, that's a different, um, oh, so I, I showed you the Tokyo banana. That's the most famous um, gift food to give from Tokyo. But I, to be honest with you, there's nothing special about it. I don't know what makes the banana so special for Tokyo. It's like they take all of my images. That Tokyo banana takes all of the bananas in the city that doesn't get eaten. They mush it up, process it, and put it into a cake. That's sort of my image, but you know, who knows? Okay, gate 18. This terminal for Jal does not look really special. <laughs> it looks like this could be any airport in the world, right? All right, gate 18. Vending machine. All right, there's gotta be something cool in there, right? Da -da -da. Vending machine, Unigiri. Remy Rodriguez, do you think about the Olympics being there? Yeah, and I wonder how busy and crazy the airport's gonna be right now. Well, Unigiri on the top, some baked goods in the middle. There's an apple custard pie. Oh, gosh. I don't have time. There's some sandwiches in here. Nothing too special. There's a drink vending machine and then there's some uh, some more gift shops. They have all the boxes laid out. If I have time, I might, might make another trip out here. Uh, you can get a goodbye ramen here. There's a couple of goodbye ramens. Like a last meal before you get on the flight. Right, Mia? Mia Yanez. That's the base. I, I've eaten there a couple of times when I had time, but oh, 25 minutes I have. Now, domestic flights in Japan, you don't have to get, you, have, you, have, you, you only have to get there an hour before the flight. 
Usually um, the process is so fast and so efficient. It's pretty crazy how quickly compared to the US. We don't have a, like a TSA um, security that, that have all these body scans and stuff. It's a little bit more relaxed. I think that they do. I think that they do the homework beforehand. Ah, whoa, that's good for us. Hey now, the um, flight has been delayed. The flight has been delayed by 10 minutes. So, if you're watching this in Almaty and waiting for me on the other side, Saito-san, I'm delayed 10 minutes. <laughs> so we can go take a look at some of the other shops and I can unbox this um, astronaut takoyaki. I, I have my doubts in whether or not the astronauts actually really do eat takoyaki in space, but uh, I'll be eating it on the airplane. And that's halfway to space, right? That's sort of pretty cool. Ah, cool. Here's what you're waiting for, a really nice shot of Haneda Airport live. This is the JAL side. So most of the flight airplanes are JAL or Skymark. I wanna go see one take off. Oh, here comes one that's landing. Land, land. I saw it, I swear, I, I saw it coming in. Huh. I think the landing's on the other side, to be honest with you. But again, here's some more Tokyo 2020 stuff. There's a JAL airplane getting ready. Take off. Wonder where that flight's going. And down there's a guy. Uh, I don't know what he's doing. His job. <laughs> he's doing his job. So I'm going to Almuri today. Uh, my flight leaves in... It's delayed by 10 minutes. So... I got a little bit more time. I'm gonna take a look more at the airport and unbox this takoyaki. Let's do a quick um, loop around the restaurant area since we have some time. And then uh, I'll sit down in front of the airplanes over there and we're gonna eat some takoyaki, space takoyaki. This isn't normal takoyaki. I'm really curious about this. It's a space takoyaki. It was kind of expensive too. Think about it. It was double the price of normal takoyaki. That's not cool. Oh, that smells so good. You can't smell what I'm smelling, but it's this smell of a really um, salty soy sauce that's been diluted in, in water, like maybe some dashi, and you have the smell of um, this soba at the airport, and it, the smell's wafting over this way from, from there. Let's take a quick look. Ah, oh, very cool. Looks like a, a McDonald's of soba. The prices are six hundred, about six dollars, six to eight dollars. Whoa! These are special headphones based on occupation. Army dude, princess, bad boy, uh, pro wrestler, and I don't know what she is, but it's pink. <laughs> Pretty cool. Japan earphone. Japa earphone, it's called. I've never had these before. These are the Tokyo Tokyo Air Biscuits. <laughs> the Draimon Ningyo Yaki. Not bad. This is the Tokyo Caramel Chocolate Cookie. And I think you get maybe three of them in this beautiful box. 
And it's six six dollars for this one box. Wow. That better be a one good darn good cookie. There's there's four of them in there. Tokyo chocolate waffle sandwich. This looks pretty good. This is from Aoyama Chokora. Whoa. Double the chocolate. Here's a new take on the on like drayaki. It's a pancake from the the Ginza maple pancake. Not bad. This is about ten dollars for six. It's kind of expensive. These are kind of expensive um, gifts, but I guess when you slap when you slap Tokyo on something, you can double the price. <laughs> it's like a license to a license to steal. Slap Tokyo on it, and you can charge a lot more. This is pretty cool. There there is internet. There are internet places here. If you don't have a cell phone, that's cool. It's 100 yen, and there are some free charging places. So it says here the signal might be going in and out. I apologize for that. Oh, there's the cafe. It's, there's really not that much here. Really, uh, the JAL terminal is, is one of the more boring ones. Uh, Okay, they're boarding my flight now, so I'm gonna have to go back this way. But this, the Jal Haneda domestic terminal is not really that exciting. It's, um, it's okay. There's a bookstore here. Most of them, there's none of them that many of you can read. <laughs> Everything's in Japanese, I believe. This place is good. This is the curry rice place. I've seen this, this is the chain. Uh, MMC, I, I think it, it's a chain. It's organic, and uh, yeah, it looks pretty good. I, I, I wish I had time to eat, but the domestic flights in Japan don't have meals, so my space takoyaki will be eaten on the plane. I wonder if I can keep the how, how long can I keep the this live stream going? Can I live stream on the airplane? Do you think Do you think they would be okay with that? That's pretty. Okay, you know what? I'll just see how long I can go. Carlos Mitchell, my fellow Disney fan friend, hey. <laughs> Thanks for the super chat. So tonight, I'm going to Aomori to make a video on Maguro. And I was invited by a friend of mine, and he, uh, he w when I was doing an episode called the um, Extreme Airport Snow Plowing, this was a, a group called White, White, um, White, I forget the name of it now. But they, they, pl they plow the airport at Aomori so well, and it, they're kind of famous in, in Japan, so I went there and made an episode about them. And I made some friends with the local prefecture, and they invited me back. Um, it's not a sponsored video. I'm, I'm paying for everything myself. And uh, they invited me back to Maguro Fishing, and he said, look, we know a guy. Uh, you might be interested in it, and we'll... Oh, this way. I keep freaking out because I don't want to miss my flight either. But he um, invited me back from Maguro fishing. So I, I've, I've eaten Maguro. I've seen them cut open the Maguro, the tuna in Skiji Market. But I've never seen um, like catching the Maguro from the sea and then having that experience. And then from that, follow it all the way to the end process where you're eating it. That's sort of what I want to try to do. Um, at least give you that, the, the image from sea all the way to plate. And uh, I think it's kind of an, a unique experience. I really, what I want to do is to stay home. I, don't, I didn't want to travel at all, but when the opportunity like this comes along, you have to kind of uh, take it. I have so much editing to do and so much work to do back in my studio. Um, there's an episode on the a one-year-old sushi, 
which I've finished editing, but I can't upload it until I return back in a couple of days. So there's, there's just so much for me to do, and yet travel calls. And when an opportunity like this comes, you can't turn it down, I think. I have to film it. And this episode will be put up in September on Magro. And this episode will be put up right now because it's live. <laughs> uh, uh, they're not boarding the plane yet. So it's right now 52 p.m. in Tokyo. I'm gonna unbox I'm going to unbox this space takoyaki for you. Um, where's a good place to do that? Look, they wrapped it. They wrapped it twice. <laughs> it's in a bag, and then they put it in another bag. That's so Japanese. I don't want to go too far away from my gate. I just got this feeling. Ah, Terada-san. Ima streaming is just. Hey. Do you think the astronauts eat this in space? Excuse me? Where did you buy it? At the uh, gift Takoyaki. shop. <laughs> yeah, it's space takoyaki. Ah, no. I've never seen it. Yeah. Do you like it? So. Sauce is sweet. Mmm. Try. Alright, so let's do a quick takoyaki unboxing. Ah. It's just a little bit of soy. <laughs> All right, so let, let me unbox this puppy. All right, here's a chair. Yeah, I don't really want to sit next to anybody because I know I'm going to bother them. There's priority seats, but I get nothing priority about me. I'm not really a priority. Okay. Hello. So it's nice to sit down here. I'm going to do my best to unbox this thing for you. It's more like unwrap it because it's in a, inside of an envelope. All right, here we go. Space takoyaki. You ready for this? Takoyaki. Oishiso. How do I unbox it and hold it? Okay, here we go. Ah! There it is. Takoyaki from space. Oops. Um, I don't know. It, it's just like a big crunch ball. All right, let's see how this tastes here. Okay, ready? Space takoyaki. Hmm. Oh. I found. Wow. All right, okay. So it really does taste like takoyaki. Konnichiwa. Doko ikimasu ka? Bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> and doko ikimasu ka? No. Aoki na ine. Aomori. So it it looked like it was just a air puff, right? Like there was nothing inside, but it was actually quite heavy, the space takoyaki. Um I took a bite in it and there was volume to it. It wasn't just a crunch, there was a lot in there. And in the middle, I did taste the um, piece of taco, the octopus. 
So Mar uh, Mark Joseph Del Rosio, thank you very much. Uh, if it's possible, I want an Only in Japan episode on the manga Arthur Yoshihiro Togashi. Uh, you know what, Mark? Um, thanks for that. I, I interviewed a lot of um, manga artists for who do Shonen Jump, and um, I think you might get what you want. <laughs> So uh, that's coming up after this episode. The next episode is going to be on Shonen Jump Weekly, which is a magazine, uh, a, a weekly series um, manga that uh, has One Piece and Hunter x Hunter and, and, and all the other really big ones. Um, Dragon Ball Z, for example, that's in Shonen Jump. And it's, it's all started from this weekly manga. So that's coming up next. Um, PHP, I believe, is Philippines. So thank you very much. Uh, I am starting to see people getting anxious to board. In Japan, people are pretty orderly. They stay until they're called. <laughs> and then in the US, we start lining up and then they'll tell us, don't line up. So we take one step back and then we line up again. <laughs> That's my first come, first serve. Beautiful day for flying though. I'm really happy to be going to Aomori. Despite all the work I have waiting for me back in Tokyo when I come back, it's, it's nice to, to get away for a little bit and have a little adventure. It's a beautiful day. On the other side over here, I believe that's the um, Ana side, right? So all those flights are A and A flights. Aomori is, is in Tohoku. Aomori is the northernmost prefecture of Tohoku. Uh, tonight, I also might be live streaming from Aomori. They're having a, um, uh, the, I think it's the last night of Nebuta Matsuri. Nebuta is the biggest, I think, the number one festival in Japan. It's awesome. And I have my, uh, in, in the bag that I checked in, I have a, a Haneto dancer, Haneto Yukata. And that's the dancers, because uh, I, I, I did an episode, um, the Nebuta Festival episode two years ago on Only in Japan. So you can go and check that out. You'll know everything about what I'm doing tonight. I'm going to try to live stream it. I'm going to try to live stream the Only in Japan, uh, um, the Nebuta Matsuri Festival. Uh, there's going to be a lot of people. I don't know if the connection is going to be good enough, but it's, it's going to be pretty fun. Um, yeah, it looks like everybody is starting to board. I wonder if I can take you on the plane. Do you think you're gonna let me, how, how long can I live stream for? I mean, live streaming is sort of a new concept in Japan. Everyone's looking at me. <laughs> you know when people are staring at you? I get that feeling like that. People are watching what I'm doing. But there's 537 of us watching, so. It's pretty cool. Um, I'll be in Aomori tonight, the 5th, 6th, 7th, and 8th, and the 8th at night, I fly back to Tokyo, uh, yeah, on, the, on a night flight, and I go straight back home and I start editing. Um, as soon as I get home, I'll finish up the editing of this uh, One Year Sushi episode, and then it's going online on the 9th, so it's going to be pretty exciting to, to release this because, you know, this one year old sushi is pretty crazy. So I'm eating maguro sushi, which is all fresh. This one's a year old. And the way, the process that they did it, this is the history of sushi, what you're seeing. This one-year-old sushi, that's why they have sushi, if you believe it or not. Sushi was invented um, this way. This, the reason why it's one-year-old is because they preserved the fish in the rice. Meaning, they didn't, hundreds and hundreds of years ago, this sushi isn't the sushi that you and I know. It's sushi that was fermented. So you could eat it at any time because people didn't have refrigerators. And uh, this way of fermenting it was a way to preserve the fish and, and so you wouldn't have to throw it out. And uh, they still do this today in the area that I, I filmed in. I'm really excited to bring this episode because nobody has done anything about it really well on YouTube in English. So it's gonna be um, it was a special episode. I'm glad that they allowed me um, permission to film that. <laughs> I 
Lots of kids on this flight. I'm still eating the takoyaki. <laughs> I had one takoyaki, space takoyaki. And I'm still kind of tasting it. But everything, everything um, with the airline is digital now. I don't even have a ticket. The ticket is digital. It's um, it's like on my smartphone. See? You can't even see it. Yeah. Just a barcode. They didn't have this when I was a kid. <laughs> Pretty cool. Um, looks like the flight's not going to be boarding for a while. I might be cutting this part out later on of the live stream. Kind of boring. Uh, but I think most of you have seen what an airplane looks like. I don't know if you want to, if you're interested in seeing more what a, what an airplane looks like on the inside. But it's pretty cool how the Olympics have has really energized the city. You see 2020 logos, uh, AmsterdamVideo.com, enjoy a drink and travel. I'm going to get that right now. How about that, okay? Amsterdam, you're on, man. I'm going to go get a drink because I know I might not get another chance. Let's see here. Thank you for that. Thank you all for the super chats. I really do appreciate that because um, they help support the bandwidth. I have the Cadillac plan, <laughs> like the most expensive uh, bandwidth plan to make sure I, I don't get cut off. And uh, oh, look, there's, a, there's somebody else with a, a uh, selfie stick. It's not just me. All right, I'm gonna get some coinage and get a drink. And this is on the Mr. Amsterdam. Thank you. That's awesome. All right. I'm getting... I love carbonated water. I found that, you know, um, I, like, I, I used to like Coca-Cola, but I found I didn't care about the sugar. I just wanted the bubbles. And uh, carbonated water is, is healthier for you. So thank, thank you for that. Why water? Mm, I didn't want tea. And I wasn't feeling like Coke. And water is refreshing and bubbly. It's um, this is carbonated water. I like it. What's the big deal? <laughs> I'm not getting a beer. I got I got a lot of work to do. I have my laptop in here, so I'm gonna try to edit on the plane. I don't want to get um, plowed. <laughs> it's it's not even 3 p.m. I don't. I have a rule. I don't drink beer until um, 5 p.m. It's, 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 it might be a stupid rule, but it keeps me from, uh, you know, being an idiot. <laughs> like, so there's a bunch of people waiting now. Char Clark loves it. Yeah, I'm not the only one. There's more people out there that love carbonated. And this is an American brand, Wilkinson's. They, they've been around since 1902. It's 1904. I don't know how they made it to Japan, Wilkinson's, but they're... They're big in Japan now, so Wilkinson's, welcome to Japan. They, I didn't see them a, a few years ago. Oh, hey, Peter is online. Remember, you, remember, you all remember Peter. Tell us another one, bro. Peter, what are you talking about, dude? I, I don't know what you're talking about. Tell us another one. What are you, be more specific, Peter. You know? Yes. These are all, Peter, you know, I bring you on the show, we go to a department store, we eat Tsukiman, we ride your scooter, and you're, Peter's becoming the new Toby. Don't drink before three. Oh, that's what you mean, yeah, okay. I should just call up Peter. All right, Peter, I'm gonna call you up. Are you working, Peter? All right, you know what? I can't do this chat thing. 
Why didn't you invite me, Peter? Look, you know, I, I'm i going on a job. So, yeah. Uh, I mean, do you have free time for the next four days, Peter? Peter good, Toby bad. Julie. <laughs> That's pretty funny. All right, let's get, let's see if Peter's around. Now here's Peter's, Peter's back. He, he works out apparently. I work out, I work out too. You there? Are you there? Peter? 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 Peter! It says it's unstable. You know what? If Toby's so good... <coughs> Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna call him. I'm just gonna call him using the regular phone. We're still waiting for the flight. <laughs> Alright, Peter's calling me now. Peter? Yeah. Are you there? Yeah, I'm here. What's up? So what are you doing, like, commenting and stuff? You're ruining my flow, dude. Well, because I was sitting at home and lonely, and I'm just wondering uh, why you didn't invite me. I didn't invite you because I'm going on a location we shoot, and they didn't want they didn't want Peter on the location shoot. It's not me, it's them. They didn't want dead weight? I don't know. <laughs> or they didn't want me stealing the show? Probably. <laughs> they saw they saw the, the department store live stream we did the other day and that was too much for the, the humble people in Aomori. <laughs> that they're gonna leave well, you and your you and your briefs can stay in Tokyo, I think. <laughs> you, you just let them know we're just getting started. Yeah. That was that was rated G. Yeah, yeah. You're the one that went into the adult only section, so <laughs> We got the whole alphabet to go through. Wait till oh we get to gosh, yeah. rated C. <laughs> yeah, have you Where ever you been? To? Have you been to Aomori before? Uh, yeah, I have for the Nebuta Festival. Oh right, yeah, that's where I'm. That's where I'm going tonight. I'll be I'll be live streaming oh, really? that one. Oh man, your people are in for a big treat. Now I already made an episode about this two years ago. Yeah. Yeah. I don't yeah, know if I can great, if, great. if I can get the signal to live stream it. That's a it's oh it's so fun. Yeah, it is a pretty good festival. Yeah, yeah, we'll enjoy it. How long are you gonna stay? Just for four days. That will shoot. That's a long time. Some people are uh, calling you a predator, Peter. I don't know what this means. <laughs> uh, well, Peter is the best only in Japan sidekick. Thank you very Peter much. Peter is I so dope. That. <laughs> Second is that old Peter is playing while talking to John. They really love you, Peter. Peter, well, you smoke you. weed. Peter has foreskin. <laughs> Toby versus Peter. Peter versus Toby. <laughs> they wow. Okay, yeah. Wait, wait, who's, I who's, love hang Peter. On, hang on, who's Toby? Who's Toby? I don't. Toby's a, this really annoying dude who's He's not a, a bad guy, but yeah. Is he a troll? It's a long story. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay, we're well, the boarding. The boarding now. All right, okay. Peter. All right. Uh, all right, I'll talk to you later. You yeah, have a great trip, and uh, we'll be in touch while you're on the road. All right, cool. Think of some ideas we can live stream. Okay. See you guys. All right. Bye. Bye bye. That was Peter. That's cool. You can just call him up, and uh, like, why is he chatting? He just called me. Peter's call. You know, dude. All right, I'm getting on this flight. Now everyone's getting up, and there's a lot of. A lot of people wondering what's what's up. I totally want to take you on the plane, but I don't know if that's gonna happen. First of all, my battery's gonna die. Trekkeress is back in. I want more Jennifer. Oh, Trekkeress likes Jennifer. I, I I saw the comments you made on that ramen video, the uh, ramen cake. So I know Trekkeress. So I did get this one ticket. This is the uh, Tokyo to Aomori ticket. For Japan Airlines. I found it crushed in my pocket. Um, you know, you know what the funny thing is? For domestic flights, they don't check your ID. I noticed that they don't check your ID. So, like, 
wow. I thought that was really weird. They don't ask for a driver's license or anything or passport. They already know who I am by the time I get to the counter. And you're allowed to bring water in, so you can bring liquids in. In the U.S., they're very strict about what you can bring on, bring through um, TSA, through the scanners. Here, you can bring liquids. I mean, Japan is so far ahead of, of America when it comes to flight boarding planes. It's just such a, a seamless process here compared to the U.S. Nothing against the U.S., it's just, I don't know if it's needed, all this security. I mean, yeah, we need it, but not to that extent. I think you can do a lot of stuff before you, people get on the flights to figure out who they are. Right? Um, oh, the flight is boarding. I'm sitting in the front of the plane. I paid an extra, I paid an extra eight dollars to get um, semi, like premium second class. <laughs> it was only an extra eight dollars. I'm like, okay. I'm, I want to sit next to the window, so I went premium extra class. Right. So I have my ticket on my wallet. You know, iPhone has this thing called a wallet. It's pretty cool. That's my ticket. So I just scan that and I'm in. People with special needs. Yeah, I need to get on the plane. Does that count? <laughs> Uh, Mr. Erkagoge 68 Mr. Ero, Erokage 68 Let me turn around So thank you for the super chat This festival is called Nebuta So Nebuta is the biggest festival My favorite festival in Japan It's on tonight Priority boarding I'm not a priority as I said I gotta wait for general, general boarding You can see that very beautiful flight attendant. Uh, she's she's no she's grounded. <laughs> and I guess when flight attendants get in trouble, they get grounded, right? <laughs> uh, oh, this is gonna be fun. You know what I really love about about when I get invited to do these trips? When I arrive in Aomori, there's somebody waiting for me who's holding a sign with my name up, and that's super cool. Uh, I don't think he's gonna hold a sign up with my name because he probably knows who I am already. All right, I'm going on. It worked! I'm in! I'm going on the airplane. So cool. Airplane boarding the airplane. Just thought it might be good to have some music. Alright. I guess you're coming you guys, you guys are coming with me. This is cool! You're coming with me on the airplane! Is this illegal? Is this wrong? Oh, this is the part where... Oh, these... I can tell that the... Oh, there's a captain! These guys look really experienced. Good news. Wow, we have Wi-Fi. Hey, it's a... Feels like first class, but it's not. It's 
like second premium. This is pretty cool. I have brought the DJI Mavic Pro with me on this trip. This is gonna be a badass trip. Drone. Should I do a walkthrough? I think you've seen, you see what an airplane looks like, so I'm not sure what I'm gonna show you. Blanket? Blanket? I'm still streaming. <laughs> no, no, no. I think you've all seen what an airplane looks like, right? So, not really much to show you. Oh, I think I'm doing more harm than good right now, so I better just take a seat. This, this does look like a first class seat. Ugh. This does look like it, it, sitting in the first five rows is pretty cool. It, it feels like... I have like a really wide armrest. Might need that later. Don't know how that takoyaki is gonna react to turbulence. So this flight has Wi-Fi. Wait a minute. Okay, hold on a second. So this flight has Wi-Fi. Can I still live stream from the air using the airplane Wi-Fi? Can this live stream just keep going all the way to Aomori? Is that possible? Can you live stream from Tokyo to Aomori in the air all the way across Japan? It makes me wonder, like, what's not possible these days? It says it's free. This is incredible. Oh, it's a free campaign. I have to launch my browser and stuff. This is so cool. This is like the coolest moment ever. Some Disney. Oh, so this is a 767. Um, I always read the directions because you, you never know what's going to happen in case of an emergency. Carlos Mitchell, do it, do it. What, what was it supposed to do? Oh, like live stream, okay. I'll see, I'll see how long we can do it then. So, these are important. Oh, look at that dude crawl. I should have had the beer. Makes it easier to crawl if you've been drinking. All right, I, I got this covered. I think I'll, I'm okay to even prep a baby now. Um, there's no tray. Did you notice this? There's no, there's no, no TV. Here's the tray. It's one of these. I guess domestic flights don't have... I guess domestic um, flights don't have TVs and stuff.
味がないよねないよね<笑>ないよねいご飯もないでしょないシャンペーンもない<笑>何もない<笑>あコーヒーある There's no, there's no beer, there's no、um, alcohol, there's no food on domestic flights, there's no service, no television, no games, but there's coffee. It's something that's good. So apparently, they're telling me also that I have to shut off all the electronic equipment at takeoff, so the stream's not gonna be able to make it. There's no way it can hide the selfie stick. <laughs> Although I'm trying, I'm trying, but I don't think it's gonna work, folks. Yeah, yeah, I got that look of death just right now.、Uh, she just told me I gotta turn off the phone. Well, it was pretty fun while it lasted. Her English is pretty good. Okay. Alright, I just got the turn it off sign. Uh oh. So thank you, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting in trouble. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for. Oh, they have like.、Uh, they're giving headphones out now. So. Oh, blankets. I could use a blanket. Wait, no, I, I took a blanket. I, I took one. Well, we took two blankets. That's, That's why I like Jal. Everyone has big smiles on Jal. I think Ana, they're very serious. Sitting in the middle, so it's sort of not the best seat in the world. Hana is a five star airline. Yeah, maybe international, but domestic, it's you know what? It has nothing special. Hana, if you want to work with me and, and fix your problems, <laughs> I'm happy to help you. I'm not, I, if, I, I like Hana, but if, if I have a choice between Hana and Jal, I always pick Jal, and I don't know why. I think it might be the colors. I like red better than blue.、Hmm. Stream to emergency landing. I'm not gonna do that. You guys have some pretty freaking hot. Oh, Peter's right and enjoy the flight. Okay, alright, dude. It's gonna be a good flight. So, I, I think this is the end of the stream. I don't know what else I can do. I'm getting the, the evil eyes because the doors have closed and they're not trying. You're giving away stuff. Alright, so. Oh, this is a map of Japan. This is flight time. Alright, everybody. Thanks for following me all the way from the airport onto the plane, which is probably a live streaming first. So, thanks everybody for tuning in and, and everybody for the, the、uh, super chats. I appreciate that.、Uh, the takoyaki was pretty good. I'm still tasting that space takoyaki.、Uh, but I'm going to try to live stream from Aomori and I'll be online、uh, a couple of times. So, definitely、uh, stay tuned to the Go channel and subscribe if you haven't already because、uh, the channel could always use a little bit more love. So, thanks everybody. See you on the other side, maybe in a few hours.